Have you ever wondered what grabs users' attention when they land on your website? You could conduct eye tracking studies to track users' eye movement, but planning a study like this takes time and money, which we don't always have during the iterative design process. So here's a hack to help you quickly determine what may stand out to users throughout your design process, and that is the screen test. The screen test is a simple squinting evaluation of a design to identify the most visually prominent elements in a composition. When we squint our eyes, the blur vision allows us to focus on the things that really stand out. This is an effective way to understand the perceived visual hierarchy and the overall balance of a page. Let's test out on interface. Take a look at this design. Now, slightly squint your eyes until things get a little blurry in your vision. What is the first element that jumps out to you? What about the second? Now stop squinting and let your eyes relax. Did your view look something like this? I'm guessing the first thing that stood out to you was the image on the left. Maybe you also noticed the bold red text and this row of images. Knowing on the order in which you see things with blurred vision can give you a sense of the perceived grouping and visual hierarchy of the page. Now, another way to achieve a similar effect is to leverage the blur tool in our design software. This is a restaurant landing page. And from the left to the right, we have the original screenshot, the screenshot blur with the radii of 5, 10, and 20 pixels. At a glance, this is a page with many things going on. It might be challenging to align on what stands out the most. As we increase the blurring effect, the Learn More button gradually fades into the image background, whereas the colorful drinks from the same image start to come forward and attract more attention. In addition, with the 20 pixel blur, you can barely locate the headlines, but the empty form fields on the top still maintain a strong visual hierarchy due to their high contrast with the dark background. So how do we fix this screen? Typically, there are three ways you can improve your visual hierarchy. Color and contrast, scale, and grouping. Let's apply some of these methods to the page. If we increase the size of the headline, pump up the contrast between the Learn More button and the Hero image, and add a clear boundary to the bottom section to reinforce grouping, you'll see that when we do a screen test again, the Learn More button now stands out. The headline is clear and emphasized and our eyes can tell that three content groups on this page, the overall visual hierarchy becomes much more clear. Oftentimes, we are so caught up in getting every detail pixel perfect that we forget to zoom out and look at the big picture of our design. Keep the screen test as a tool in your back pocket, and remember to always take a step back to see how your design is catching attention. Sometimes, Blurred vision can help us see our designs more clearly. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more of our UX videos, take a look at these over here and consider subscribing to our channel. On our website, nngroup.com, you can access our free library of over 2,000 articles. You can also register for one of our UX courses that offer live, hands on UX training.